Hello and welcome to the Ski Challenge 2013. Finally it's out. And um, I've already done some uh, adjustments. For instance, I've logged in and I've set my character to look like it always looks. Or at least how it looked last year. Um, yeah. Welcome to the Ski Challenge 2013. Uh, so this time, obviously, we've got all the special modes on each and every track. Wow. Well, let's go into the time race up there, which is the normal qualification. Um... Did they... Oh, there you go. Oh, that's nice. Okay, we start in Valgardena like... Not many times before, actually. <laughs> it's been a while since we started the World Cup in Valgardena. Well, let's see how much the track will have changed or if it changed at all. And I really like the soundtrack this year. <laughs> so, Varkadena. Let's see how much the ski settings from last year are worth. If that fucking thing actually loads. Uh, <clears throat> Thank you. I want my own. Um, there was 24, 41, 53, uh, 35, 53, yeah, sure. Um, <laughs> uh, I do, oh, you can have multiple ghosts this time, which is a nice thing too. Um, I'll just use the next best ghost, which would be the last in the ranking right now. So I'll probably uh, just take the best one. I want to know how much I'm really behind. <laughs> Graphics haven't changed really as much as I see. Uh, yeah, uh, this is the favorites tab, which uh, I haven't shown you in the previous ones because you need to be online. This is uh, actually you can enter any uh, username here and have them uh, listed in your favorites. I always put myself in there because I uh, ha have it easier to just use my ghost then uh, without typing my username each and every time. And also I put in some friends and my, my father also plays this, so... <clears throat> anyway, I don't want to see the ghost and we're going to start this right away. And a Swiss guy is on top of the list, actually, this. And actually, this key, you can just keep this key from last year. This plays like last year's game. Uh, you probably hear some thing right now in the background which is my phone which I actually forgot to turn off it's just a, a text message so I'm not going to pause this yeah stop ringing already thank you <coughs> Oh, that was shitty. That was really shitty. And I'm already two seconds behind. Fuck! I should look at the time. Restart the shit. We're going to look into the special modes uh, real quick after I finish my first run in this. But this really is just like last year's game.
It looks like last year's game, it plays like last year's game. I really don't have the feeling that they changed anything apart from the special modes just being available on every track this year. Which is not a bad thing, because last year's game was good, so I guess... Oh, they added a few bumps in the in the track, but well, that's about as much as they can change about the track. I still don't like that part, but well. So, now concentrate to not hit a gate again. You can still use the fucking jump button to steer. Which isn't supposed to be... But I guess they would have to to work uh, work out a new physics engine for that to uh, not work anymore, and that would be uh, a lot of stuff to do in just one year of development, or less than one year, because right now they uh, aren't developing the next one. I guess they start with that after this one. Um, let's see, 110 now, well, that's not going to last, but 209, um, how fast did I go there? What? What? My best time last year was 209, 142, and I'm already at 209, 578. Um, I guess I really have a chance to get in the, into the uh, top 1000 this time. Well, let's look into the other modes, shall we? Um, and I'll just do them in training mode this time, just because. Well, start with the free ride, which is, yeah, the rowdy mode from last year, where you just go without any uh, rules, past all gates. And this is actually a quite a good mode to uh, see whether um, well to to see my my um, to see whether my settings for the uh, um, a good mode to explore the track for the uh, at science slalom. I was going to say. Can go through here. Which is nice. The making of the add some sl slalom uh, will maybe up tomorrow or uh, the day after tomorrow. I'm not really sure when I'm going to do that. Can go through here again. Yes, that's still working too. And that should work. Eh. Just try that from another angle. God damn it! There you see. Now you see why I'm doing this in training mode because. Um, in online mode you can't reset and I don't want this video to be like an hour long. Because come on, nobody watches an hour of me skiing. 
at least not back to back. So let's see how far out we can get here without falling. All the way, nice. And here, I guess we're gonna fall. No, we're not going. Oh, that's some really good stuff there. I guess just for my essence slalom, I'll guess I'll just use this training mode. Since you can reset, you can uh, do anything you can do in the real one and he doesn't just stand up and look back which always looks kind of awful in the AdSense slalom. 158 well uh, didn't we have a free ride we did have one but I didn't write that down anyway um, yeah, since I'm just going to use last year's key. Anyway. Um, maybe we'll look. The time bomb is, ex is exactly the same thing we had last year. Arcade. Yeah, exactly the same maybe. Uh, maybe a new... Uh, Blitz Eyes. Uh, I guess that's one thing uh, that is actually the same word in uh, English, Blitz Eyes. Uh, I, I, I could be wrong about that, but... I think I know how to talk. Um, anyway, this essentially is the same thing as the uh, Extreme Eyes mode last year. Oh. Then, uh, Tarfat, yeah, that's the, um, that's the Jagate edition again, <laughs> where you're driving like you're drunk. Uh, what's the extreme one? Only with the, oh, helmet cam. <laughs> And with oh, that's realistic. Only helmet cam and without the uh, the the actual time displayed. I'm going to do that online, just to see how the others are doing. Um, essentially with the same ski since it's sun, I guess. Um. Sun, sun, sun. Yeah, I totally forgot to log out of the uh, Steam friends again. I'm sorry. Uh, 24, what was that? 41. Um, yeah, that's still the same. Uh, since I'm not going to see anything, might as well go like that. That helm helmet camera really has a nice view to it. And it's actually quite realistic. I usually don't use this cam, but... Uh, You could totally uh, uh, dub the commentary of the uh, Austrian television guy who always, uh, who's an ex-skier and and uh, always does this helmet uh, cam things for the Austrian television. You can totally dub his commentary over that. <laughs> and uh, one guy in the forums actually did that for quite a, a few years. Uh, he hasn't done it in the last year, I think. 
But I would like to see that back, actually. I like that. Ah! Nowhere near my best time. <laughs> this is really the most realistic it gets. Now, I'm really... I didn't actually crash that, something I wouldn't have thought is possible. Let's see. Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Obviously, no one of the actual good uh, uh, players actually played this yet. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> I'm number one. <laughs> nice to see this is now documented on YouTube. <laughs> well, um, so much of that mode, and we'll just uh, do. Uh, snow to see if there's any difference there. Real quick, I don't know how how long I'm already recording, but I don't really care since uh, these episodes are going to be uh, me showing off the track. Uh, that's actually the same in there and. Less here, and that should be real. Oh no, that was Beaver Creek. I'm really not that good at looking up stuff. Um, 10, 11. Uh, that's still the same. Play. Oh, I'm in training mode? Did I? Yeah, obviously I am. Yeah. I'm going to have to train on this track anyway since... Snow and ice is always something I really don't like. Okay, we need another ski on this. This is not going to work with the one from last year. Uh, and I'm actually going to do this online. Yeah, welcome. Uh, snow. There we go. Uh, what is a little bug? It, you, as you saw, it stays in the helmet camera when you did the uh, extreme uh, mode. Which I don't really like because I have to, to set it back. I mean, it's just pushing one button, but anyway, come on. It's not necessary. What I should actually try is if, uh, yeah, I guess they tried that in the beta test, test whether you can switch to the normal cam in the extreme mode. I don't think you will be able to. Uh. If you're wondering why I'm actually giving out my ski settings, um, the guys in the forums uh, all really have the same settings in the end because uh, the top guys uh, give out their ski, ski settings and there's also uh, an application uh, which tells you the ski settings of each and every one in the ranking. Not like you 
uh, not like Green Cube actually uh, uh, did that one, but. It's not unfair since. Come on. It's just ski settings. It's about skill and not the settings. And I really don't have skill right now. I'm really just half a second behind the best one on this track right yet. Well, let's see how far behind I am now. Really just half a second. It should be about, ranking wise, it should be top 10. Fourth place. Uh, as you see, there really aren't that much uh, who already played on snow. Uh, since being a fourth place usually means... Uh, you have a 100% of people, uh, this is the percentage of people that are slower than you. And usually, if you're in the top 10, this is going to tell you you're 100%, uh, you're, you're faster than 100% of the competition. Which isn't true, but it's so close to uh, 100%, 99.9, uh, 99, and, on, and so on that uh, it essentially rounds it up to 100 in the end. Since place 4 has 90% of people behind... Yeah. There aren't really that many. I don't think there's much, uh, much going on past the top 10. And I'm surely not going to stay anywhere near the top 10 in any ranking. So... Um, yeah, I think this does it for this episode. Uh, as you see up here, uh, if you can read German, <laughs> that is, uh, Ski Challenge 13 also available on Android and iOS, in the App Store or on Google Play. For, yeah, free download, just like the PC game. Download links below in the description. This does it for this episode. Until next time, I'm WWE Deadman. Like and favorite and if you liked what you just saw and subscribe for more. Uh, and until next time, bye.